Just where I was standing at, uh, right here. For Chef James Turner, cooking was a calling at just five years old. You know, while you know some kids were probably watching, you know, cartoons on Saturday morning, I was watching great chefs on PBS. With decades under his belt working in the food industry, he was ready for a new recipe. He invested more than fifty thousand dollars into what he calls a dream opportunity. Turner's Beltway Bistro, a food truck. I was going to do things that people would totally identify with right now. Well, that's all on hold because Turner's dream turned into a nightmare on Memorial Day. After getting all the inspections he needed, Turner returned the truck to this lot where he keeps it parked in Silver Spring. On Monday, proud of what was to come, he went to show the truck off to one of his employees. We pull up and the truck's gone. Is somebody playing a joke? You know, maybe it was towed. Being stolen was probably third or fourth things that I thought of. Gone just weeks before he was ready to roll it out to the D.C. region. You know, the, the equipment was worth more than the truck itself. Well, Turner tells us if he were to start all over, it would take months. He says he has other plans to keep money coming in in the meantime by working his other job and cooking from a shared kitchen, but he's not throwing in the towel. My main focus right now is to, to get things going back again. Um, I, I wish I could say something, you know, profound and, and like berate whoever did it, but that doesn't help me now. <laughs> you know, like I have to get back on my grind and get things going again. Yeah, who steals a food truck? Police in Montgomery County are on the lookout for Turner's truck, but so far nothing. They say if you saw something or know anything, give police a call.